I don't know ultimately who decided on Death Star, but we do know, we do know that the Empire likes to be very imposing and intense. That's a great name, yeah. before our little puny little tiny thing, but it's puny and tiny compared to planets. It's not puny and tiny if you're trying to build the darn thing. Yeah. So here's some estimation. How much would the steel cost to build a Death Star? 750 quadrillion dollars. So it goes, for those of you who don't talk, speak in quadrillions, it is, it goes millions, 10 to the six, billions, 10 to the nine, trillions, 10 to the 12, quadrillions, 10 to the 15. Do we have that much material on Earth? Can we mine that much material from Earth? No. Let's get to the hyperlaser. <laughs> the blast in Blasteroid. <laughs> you love a good laser so a modern high energy laser costs a million dollars per kilowatt this thing it costs roughly 60 quintillion dollars in energy infrastructure alone to build the laser so last time we were at quadrillion to build the structure building the laser is a thousand times more expensive suppose you have your structure built you have your laser built you gotta power the laser it's like building a, 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 a energy grid for planet Earth, right? About the same thing. That's cheap by comparison, $50 trillion. So then you need a propulsion system. And again, you know, hyperspace drive. Again, you talk about another hundred quadrillion dollars. You need to create artificial gravity. Uh, you need life support, your defense systems, your command and control system, space docking. And so total estimated cost is about $400 quintillion. Or about the budget of, I don't know, choose your small, the Cook Islands. <laughs> <laughs> choose your small country.